Hello and welcome back to L Squad Creations. Here's another Dollar Tree haul for you. I have actually was very surprised with this Dollar Tree haul. I was able to find two items that I really, really wanted and was looking for. And I was surprised at some of the things that I wasn't looking for that I did find. But let's move right along, get into this Dollar Tree haul, and we're going to get it started. First up, I was able to locate the Tri um, Planter that has the three little planters in there. So I was able to get one, two of these, and they go like this. I actually was hoping... <clears throat> To get these and when I found them I was so surprised I was shocked I was like whoa they have them and I would have liked to have gotten more so hopefully I'll be able to go back and get at least I want at least maybe four more because what I want to do is do a DIY with these as well I had a great idea what I wanted to do with them and then it slipped my mind I'm like oh my gosh I should have wrote it down so whenever you have an idea of something to do for a DIY or just something in general you want to do, write it down. Because if you're like me and forget, and it's like, oh no, now what do I do? But since I couldn't remember what I originally wanted to do, I came up with another idea. So maybe by doing that idea, I will get back to my original idea and be able to create two of them. So anyway, I was able to get two of these. And like I said, hopefully I'll be able to get at least three or four more of these. We're going to move these off the table since it's not enough room. Next, I was able to score the Detoxifying Body Wash um, Microalgae Plus Ginseng. We'll move it up close to the camera so you can see. Try not to get that glare in there. There you go. Root fruit enzymes boost radiance and improve skin tone. As you can see, this is 13.5 fluid ounces, which is not bad. And this is by Bolero um, of Beverly Hills. So I said, hey, I never had it, never bought it before, never tried it. So I said I would try this. It says, dispense a button-sized drop into your hands, work into a lather smooth over skin, then rinse with water. So those um, bath sponges that I bought um, a couple of hauls back, Will be good to use with this so i was glad to get this and if you haven't seen my D diy haul yet this is actually what i made from that so if you get a chance um go and check my um first diy on youtube and you will see how we created that next what i found were these Snyder's of Hanover Rod Pretzels. And the reason I buy the, bought these is normally I usually get mine from Aldi's, but these are only a dollar and I didn't need as many as I do get from Aldi's because Aldi's I think you get maybe between 40 to 60 and it's like a round tub container of these. But I said, you know, I didn't need that many. So I got these. And what I do is I make the pretzel sticks with the candy on there with my granddaughters. And they love them. So this is good if you like to try to dip them in the, the chocolate and get them, drizzle it on there. I might do a DIY doing that. I'm not sure. But these are very good. Next thing that I found was I should have did this before I did the pretzels, but I got the bath soak. And this is the coconut oil and sea salt. This is 9.8 um, ounces. Now, if you know, this is by Bolero, but you know, when Bolero first came out with their bath um, soak and their um, bath salts, the bottle was actually bigger. It was actually more like 17, if I'm not mistaken. It was 11 or 11 point or 17 point something ounces. This one is only 9.8 ounce. So it's like you're getting less than before. But this one actually 
has a better scent. This coconut oil and sea salt smells good. So I said, you know what? I'll try it. Next thing I found was, now this was from the um, holiday season, but this is a margarita cocktail mix. I actually scored this in the last haul that I forgot to show you. So it wasn't in this haul, but it was in the last haul. But I wanted to show it to you this time. This was only 25 cents when I bought it. But let's see if we can open it up. It has the little package in here. This came in there. And it's a refreshing drink for one. So this makes enough for one person. And all you do is, in a cocktail mixer or glass, you pour three ounces of that of sparkling water and then you add the powder that was in here and let it dissolve add ice and 1.5 ounces of tequila and you enjoy I'm not really a drinker but I said hey on a movie night by myself I might try this without the grandkids being around so that was something that I previously hauled now when I showed you the planners I did forget to show you this this is one that I found and I have a smaller plant that I have a big in a bigger planter, but it's too um, small for the bigger planter. So I found this one. I was like, hey, that will go with the theme of my room with the black, white, and pink. And so I got this. And as you can see, it has a embossed um, leaf design on it. So I said that would be cute to put that little plant in. And I might sit it um, over here somewhere in there and move this one to this side. I did find another planner, and this one I thought was cute because it looks like it's woven, and it's a um, almost like a brown, but not too dark brown, maybe like a beige brown sort of color. So I got this because I um, hauled last year, I had a haul of um, three plants that I actually got from Michael's for $4 each. So I do have one in my bathroom, so I'm going to stick that in here so you won't see that black um, little container that it's in. I thought this would be cute because I changed my bathroom theme into more like a safari team, theme team. <laughs> um, theme with um, brown and gold, red and orange colors in it. So I have a real beautiful pillar, pillow picture with those colors in it. So I thought this would make a nice addition to the bathroom instead of just having that black pot that that um my faux plant is in i'll put that in here instead and i thought that would be nice okay so we're almost done with this haul now next thing i found was this creation star kiss and i know everybody was doing these in a haul and a lot of people were saying that they didn't get at their store and they wanted to try it. So actually, one of my subscribers, because I have it to where if you're my first 25 subscribers would get a free gift. So I did a giveaway, I believe it was last, um, not last night, but it was okay. So it would have been Monday night because this is actually Thursday. So this was actually Monday evening. When we did this haul, was it Tuesday? One of those days. But anyway, so one of my um, subscribers won this because when I did the giveaway, I had this on that video and I just went on and pre-did it because I figured someone would want to try this. And so one of my subscribers was lucky enough to score this and she said, hey, yes, I would love to try that. So this is for her. And of course, she already knows. So next thing I scored as I was walking towards the register I found these scarves the St. Patrick scarf and I thought this was so cute because it has the green and the lime green in there lime green is my favorite color so I actually got one two of these and actually another subscriber won this um, the other night as well one of my subscribers this is what she won so this will be going out to her so walking towards the register, found something else. This shape, um, Pilates for pink workout. And I actually have a, has a free resistant band inside. So I'm trying to work, um, 
So this year I would be working out because um, for the past two years, I've been having an issue with um, respiratory problems. And I had this cough that I could not get rid of. And so I had started to develop um, asthma. So when I went last year around November to the doctor, they told me that I actually have issues with my lungs. And so they put me on steroids last year and the year before, which put a little bit of belly weight. I won't say a little bit to me. It's a lot of belly weight. So I said, you know what? I got to get this weight off me. I'm not feeling my best. So I said I would try this video and see how it helps. Now, what I'm going to do is actually I still have a few more subscribers to go. I think I'm at 19 now. So like I said, we're trying to get 25 subscribers um, to do it to be a part of a giveaway. So I'm going to see if I can go back and find one more of these. And this will be part of that next um, giveaway that we do once we hit to once we hit 25 subscribers, then we'll do a video giveaway for those um, additional um, persons that subscribe to my channel. Because I think we were at 13. No, we were. Yeah, we were at 12 or 13. The last giveaway we did. So then once we hit the 25, those remaining viewers, our subscribers will get a chance to um be a part rather of a free giveaway. So I may see if I can find one of more, more of these videos to do for that giveaway. Last but not least, I found this light. And once again, this was part of the Christmas haul, but I wanted to do a DIY with this. I had um, two I bought um, like two years ago. And I said, what, I said I should have gotten four at that time, but I didn't. But I did find this one and it lights up. You probably can see the lights in there. Yeah, you can see it a little bit. See the lights in there and you just push, turn this and it turns off. Actually, I thought this was going to ring up a quarter, but I guess because they already send out or got rid of all their Christmas items, I was able to get this for a penny. Yes, you heard me right. One cent, which was like, for me, I was ecstatic. I was like, oh man, I should run through the store and see if I could find some more in the wrong place. This actually was in a wrong area. It was near the register, just tucked in where the candy and stuff is. So I picked it up and I grabbed that. So once again, this is the end of another Dollar Tree haul with L Squad Creations. Subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up as well as hit that notification bell to be a part of our next giveaway. And like I said, once we hit 25, then once we hit the next um, 50, once we get to 50, then I have, um, I'll have a drawing for a viewer to win a um, free giveaway. Once I hit 50, we'll do a drawing to see who is the person that wins. But as for right now, you still have an opportunity to win a prize. Like I said, right now, as of the other night, I was at 13. Now I'm at 19. We're still trying to get to 25. But those viewers who subscribe now before we hit over 20 before we hit um 26 because once you get to 25 all those people from my 14th viewer to the 25th viewer will win a free giveaway and then after that because this is getting kind of expensive having to you know do the giveaway and then i still would have to mail the prizes out so what we'll do once we hit 50 we'll do a drawing pick a winner once we hit a, a hundred, we'll put everybody's name that hasn't already won something into a hat and have my granddaughter pull a name out the hat and see who wins for the 50th, the 100th subscriber, my 150th subscriber, 200 and so forth. So we'll do it that way. I may change it and I may say, hey, once we hit 25, once we get to 50, once we get to 75, once we get to 100, I might do every. 25th um you know every time we hit an additional 25 do a different giveaway then once again we'll see how it goes but shout out to my last winners which was um millennium baby to shin um oh my goodness i think it was mariah shamaya avia and i'm missing 
someone. Oh my goodness. And she's going to be so upset with me if I don't remember her name because actually she was um she has been very supportive to my channel and actually it is Norma. Norma is very supportive, giving me thumbs ups and just really giving me a lot of uh, moral support with my new channel as well as some newer viewers that I have. Um, we have new subscribers. We have um, Manessa, Marcia, Yvonne, Blue Hue, um, Cosmos, if I'm saying it right, and Cadbury Kid. And I'm not sure how to pronounce it. It's spelled H-E-L-L-O-X-E. -L -L -E. But those are my newest subscribers. Actually, that starts from number 13 and goes to 19. So we need six more subscribers to hit 25 subscribers. So keep watching my videos. I had um, one person, uh, Tashin, who actually recommended a friend of hers to watch my channel. Shout out to um, um, shouts out to Tashin for that. I really appreci appreciate that. Once again, congratulations. To my past winners, your prizes will be going out soon. Continue to watch my channel, subscribe, like it, hit the notification bell, and we'll see you in our next haul. Thank you.